say does that star spangled banner yet wave o'er the land of the free in the home Performing our national anthem, that was Skylar Cole. And now we'll be back in just a moment. And a happy Thursday evening to you folks. Hope you're ready for some NBA action here on 2K Sports. And along with Grant Hill and Doris Burke, I'm Brian Anderson, joined by Allie LaForce, our reporter. Allie, take it away. Thanks, Brian. Well, Jalen Brunson, a second-round pick out of Villanova, and his father carved out a nine-year journeyman career in the league as well. Jalen said, quote, how hard he worked just to get unguaranteed contracts showed me that I have to work 10 times harder. I thank him for letting me see that at a young age. Guys? Uh, family business. Allie, thanks. And tonight, we're looking at two teams who make their living beyond the arc, Grant. Yeah, they love to shoot the three-point shot, and they do it effectively. And, of course, that means these two teams understand the importance of good spacing. They're great shooters on both sides, to be sure, but motion and ball movement are the real keys to their three-point attacks. And let's check Miami's starting lineup. Lowry and Hero are the backcourt. Jimmy Butler out there with Caleb Martin. And it's Adebayo in at the center position. And for the Knicks. At forward, it's Barrett and Randall. Jalen Brunson is out there with Josh Hart. And it's Robinson in at center, filling out the middle. Now here's Randall to the inside. And stolen by Adebayo! Here's Butler. Doesn't go for him. Some solid defense from Barrett. Martin against Randall. Shot from 12. And misses it off the right side of the rim. And it's Miami's ball. Pass to Butler. Robinson with a steal. Lowry against Randall. And here's Brunson from the arc. That's in. Coming off an assist from Randall. Well, keep your head up. Look for an opportunity to facilitate Julius Randall the delivery. And Jalen Brunson, he's a great option on the floor, Grant. Oh, yes, he is. Can attack from different levels of the floor. Solid shooting threat from outside. And gives you another playmaker to initiate the offense. Now here's Brunson. Pass to Barrett. About a minute and a half through the first quarter. Some solid defense from Martin. Hero against Barrett. Here's Butler. Randall pulls down the board. For New York. They've gone one for three so far. Hart passes to Robinson. Outside Brunson. Screen by Robinson. Puts it up from 12. No luck on that one. And Miami the other way now. Now here's Butler. Hero outside. Randall with a steal. First quarter of ball. Almost two and a half minutes in. Five on the clock. And that one's good. Yeah. Our 
Jay Barrett with excellent vision. And it's not just the vision, it's the ability Nicely. to put it on time and on target. Zero. Nicely done. Time called here. Miami decides to talk it over. And for Julius Randle, back in 2014, a nightmare start to his career, Greg. Oh, man, so sad. I mean, Julius breaking his leg just 14 minutes into his NBA debut. A serious injury that required him to miss his entire rookie season. But give Randall credit for coming back and carving out a great career. For your next breaker, And a little over two and a half minutes gone here in the first. Martin outside. Pass to Butler. Robinson with the block. Now, no easy bucket with Mitchell Robinson in the vicinity. He sends that back with authority. Well, so great when your offense produces a shot that close to the rim. The rest of the work becomes easier. Now here's Randall. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. First Boy, when you foul. think back to 2021 and the year Julius Randle had, guys, a first-time All-Star, winner of the Most Randall. Improved Player Award that line. year, but then Two follows shots. it up with a disappointing 2022 season. First one falls for him. And talking about Randall Doris, you could see the emotions boil over at times during that 2022 campaign. B.A., there were multiple fines and altercations, and that can happen when you don't meet expectations and frustrations mount. And in particular, when you're dealing with the New York media and that passionate fan base, things can escalate. So he gets them both. It seems to me Julius Randle improves every season. And the more responsibility he's given, it seems the better he performs. Now here's Lowry to the paint. Here's Adebayo. Hart pulls it in. The Knicks with the lead. Runs it up top. He's guarded by Hero. Pass to Barrett. Outside Hart. Down low. Here's Brunson, and he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. First personal foul. It's on Tyler Hero. Well, before he arrived in the NBA, Jalen Brunson had a ton of success in college. This guy instrumental in Villanova's national title in 2018. And the first one at the line is good. For all he did at the college level, Brunson still dropped to the second round of the NBA draft doors. He did, B.A., but he showed he belonged right away. His numbers get a little bit better every season, 
at 6-1. He's a strong finisher close to the bucket. He can play the one guard. He can play the two guard. He can make open shots. He can get in the paint and score. Jalen Brunson is a big-time contributor to a high-quality basketball team. An efficient night from the line. This is a guy who puts in the work and it pays dividends. Oladipo on the way, guarded by quickly. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. Well, you can see that Oladipo has the ability to get himself to the interior, and he's Oladipo. never going to shy away from contact either. Two shots. Well, for the Knicks, what's it going to take to bring him back to the glory days? Oh, that's a loaded question, B.A. But first of all, a superstar would certainly help. They haven't really had one for quite some time. If they can either develop or attract an elite all-star player, that would be a start to turning this New York franchise around and becoming possibly a contender. And he knocks down the first one. Well, we know that Victor Oladipo is a combo guard, meaning he can play the one and the two. What I like is how impressive his overall game is and the fearlessness with which he plays. Wow. Rose has checked in for New York. He makes one or two that time. The Knicks have gone two for five here in the first. Quickly outside. The shot no good. And it's Miami the other way. Butler into the lane. Goes up and lays it in. Nice and easy. Great focus from Jimmy Butler right there. He understands contact is part of the game. He's almost inviting you to hit him. Now here's quickly. Over Oladipo. Rebounded by Butler. Miami trailing. A minute 22 left in the first. And he gets the Jimmy bucket. Butler. Butler's got his second basket of the night. Butler challenging the very heart of the defense. Everybody's trying to take away the paint. Jimmy Butler says, I own that real estate. Oladipo against quickly. And again, the Knicks missing for Miami. They've gone three of eight so far. Butler against quickly. Pass to Vincent. Back to Butler. Over quickly. And again, Jimmy Butler. Jimmy Butler. That's from Butler's got six. Vincent. You want to run your offense through him. A reliable scoring option. We've got 33 seconds left to play in the first quarter. Quickly outside. Over Oladipo. That one's wide left. Well, that's a blown defensive coverage, but it doesn't matter. He cannot answer the bell. Pass to Butler. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. First personal foul. If you want to check Jimmy Butler, you better be ready to compete. This guy is always playing hard. Two shots. That free throw, no good. Well, you can tell that Jimmy Butler absolutely thrives in a strong team environment. There is a chemistry between he and his guys that comes out on the floor in how cohesively this group plays together. And that one drops, so now they lead by one. 11 seconds left in the first quarter of the game. Quickly, outside, to win the drought. Oh, it would have counted had it fallen, but it is offline. Well, oh, good close contest so far as we finish the first quarter. It's the Heat up by one. And back to the start of the second quarter in just a moment. Big round of applause. Put your hands. 
good action in the books as we get back to a game that's been pretty close so far here. Let's quickly break down what we've seen from the Heat. It's simple. The main takeaway from the first quarter is they're winning this game with defense. I think across the board, a number of guys have done a great job guarding multiple positions. You know, with all the dunkers out there, some players make sure they don't end up on too many posters. Grant, you ever uh, make a business decision? Yeah, B.A., you know, I made a few business decisions through my career. Look, as a competitor, you want to make sure that you can play defense, give it your all, contest at the rim when you feel that you can. But when someone like a Vince Carter in the midst of insanity, that's when you make a business decision. And that's a smart decision. At the four and the five, it's Randall and Robinson. Then it's R.J. Barrett. Then there's Jalen Brunson. And it's Grimes in at the shooting guard position. Defense that's the five for New York right now. Caleb Martin, second personal foul. First team foul. Julius Randall at the line. Oh, one shot. Free throw drops for Randall. And it's Miami's ball. Trailing by two. To the middle. Here's out of Bio. And count the basket. He was fouled. And he's going to the line for one more. Bam out of Bio. One shot. To love the style Bam brings with him to the floor. He's such a spirited player, and you can see his teammates enjoy it as well. Now here's Randall. He has seven. Oh, he nails that one. Three for four now. I like that. Punch it inside. You usually end up with a good shot and or get fouled. Pass to Hero. And we're now about a minute into the second quarter of play. Struce with the bucket. Struce. Put your head down and go to work. That's what they need to do. Boy, the tide is running one way and then shifts back in the other direction. I've lost count of how many lead changes we've had here tonight. And he comes up with a bucket. Defensively, you can't afford to get stuck on the pick. You know exactly what that takes. It takes energy, it takes activity, it takes intensity. Now here's Hero. Looking for his first basket still in this one. Early in his career, Mitchell Robinson feels like an old-school big to me. This guy owns the painted area. He's completely focused on finding those close-range opportunities to score it. Here's Hero. Pass to Adebayo. It's rebounded by New York. Outside Brunson. There's the drive. Here's Grimes. Randall outside. Six to shoot. New York needs to get one up quick. The timer ticks. On target from range. Mitchell Robinson's focus on high percentage looks has given him record-setting efficiency doors. It has B.A. in the abrupt 2020 season. He finished with a field goal percentage of 74%. Chamberlain's old record. I think that says it all. Now here's Brunson. He's got seven. Pass to Grimes. The three ball. Miami grabs the miss. Hero's got four rebounds in the game. Here's Adebayo. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Adebayo's got five points in the quarter. From role player to all-star. Autobio has made the leap. Why? 
effort plays like that. Here's Randall. And they get it back. Prime shot is off. Out of, Out of bounds. It'll be New York's ball. A big group substitution here for New York. Hardenstein. He's checked in for Robinson. Toppin comes in for Randall. Hart's checked in for Grimes. And quickly subbed in for Brunson. The Knicks have gotten four of eight shots to drop in the second. And in the second quarter, a little under three and a half minutes played already. Barrett against Butler. Hart from long range. And again, the Knicks missing. Boy, he won't miss many from that spot. The defense gets lucky there. Here's Lowry. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. Oladipo outside. There's a screen by Love. Oh, plenty of contact on that shot. Officials call the foul, and he'll take two free throws now. Well, Victor Oladipo is unafraid in the face of contact. That's a nice move. Victor Oladipo at the line. Two shots. off. Rose has checked in for New York. Robinson, he's checked in for Miami. Vincent comes in for Lowry. He hits the second from the line. New York has gone one for three from downtown here in the second. Here's Rose. Benson grabs a miss. That's the shot you hope for right at the rim. Just couldn't capitalize. For three, Robinson. Can't get it to drop. New York goes the other way with it. Rose outside. Shoots from 12. And the Knicks miss again. The Heat have gotten only three of nine attempts to fall in the second. We've got 1.23 left in the first half. Love a screen on quickly. Here's Oladipo. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting. So he'll take two free throws. Second first, no foul. Third team. Victor Oladipo at the line. Two shots. That puts him up one point in the game now. And Oladipo drops them both. 116 left to play in the first half. Quickly with the ball. What? No scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. To the inside. It's Hart on the wing. Top of the screen on Robinson. Hart from long range. Love grabs the miss. Love's got four rebounds now. And for the Heat, they're shooting only 39% so far in the game. Quickly against Butler. Outside Love. Beyond the arc. Counted from distance. Love's got himself on the board with a three there. Well, this is one of Kevin Love's go-to shots now. Early in his career, a low post game. Now he's lethal from distance. To the paint. Hartenstein. And he can't stop the drought. Another miss. The Heat with the lead. About three seconds between the shot clock and the game clock. Butler up top. Can't get 
get that one to fall. Excellent D there from Toppin. And there's the lob. Oh, what a nice defensive play to disrupt the lob. The and we're through the, the half first half score. of play here in what's the been Knicks. a good one. Eat out front, leading by five. Tried Allie's ready to go. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. Thanks so much. I'm here with Coach Tom Thibodeau. And Tom, what's it going to take down the stretch to win this ball game? I think just tough defense, take good shots, not turn the ball over, play smart. Back to the basics. Thanks, Coach. Thanks, Allie. After the break, we'll see you right back here to begin quarter number three. left in a game that's been a fairly even one. Julius Randle has been sensational. Man, I love how effortlessly he scored. The game just comes so easy for him. Now let's see if he continues that trend the rest of the way. He certainly has the talent and the endurance to do just that. And in that first half, we saw a pretty tight battle. We'll soon find out what sort of adjustments were discussed during halftime. And on the floor for Eric Spolstra starting the second half. On the wing, it'll be Hero and Butler. Caleb Martin out there with Bam Adebayo. And it's Lowry in at the point guard position. Shoots a fadeaway. A nice shot by Butler. Jimmy Butler. Butler's got nine points. Don't tell me the mid-range game is dead. Jimmy Butler doing work right there. Martin against Randall. And the layup is good. He's got 11. Probably a play they drew up in the locker room at half. Well, there is nothing better than catching a rhythm as early as possible. And boy, that's a terrific start right there. Now here's Lowry. Well, he hasn't scored yet, but I'm sure that'll change. Robinson with the block. Outside Brunson. Randall outside. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Caleb Martin. That's his third foul of the game. And you've got to be in awe of incredible defensive efforts like this. Yeah, I love that they maintain the defensive energy even when they're behind. Outside Brunson. Randall outside. The three is up. And count it. Now five for seven. Well, you've got to be decisive in catch and shoot situations, and Julius Randall leaves no doubt. That's the hero. 26. 24. Just over one and a half minutes have passed in the third quarter. Out of bio. No good. New York trailing. Barrett passes to Brunson. Parked it down low that time. Got hit with the three-second call. Tough one. In a game where every possession is valuable, turnovers can make the difference. Struess, he's checked in for Miami. The Heat have gotten only one of four shots to fall in the second half. Brunson against Lowry. Pass to Struess. From downtown, it's hauled in by Robinson. Robinson's got his fourth rebound in this one. Left side Brunson. Randall is screen on Lowry. Brunson passes to Randall. Up and over Lowry. And Randall the bucket on the assist by Brunson. Randall's got seven points here in the quarter. 26. 26. Hero outside. Lowry drives in. Lays it up and in on the nice Lowry. reverse. And the Heat lead by two. Well, there you see on display Lowry's speed and his ball-handling ability. What a drive. 
Outstanding dribble drive. And that replay was brought to you by Mobile One. And the way he's been able to protect the ball from the defense is really incredible. He makes it look so easy. Now here's Brunson. He's got seven. And here's Martin. Adebayo. And finished off by Adebayo. The aggressiveness of Adebayo. He plays with so much energy and force close to the bucket. And the call is going to be, yes, an illegal screen. You can get away with one once in a while. But it looked like he wasn't completely set on that pick. I don't think there's any question. There are so many rules that favor the offense these days. You've got to be able to equal things out when an illegal screen is set. And the Knicks making a change here. Grimes has checked in. Now here's Martin. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game from him. Ooh, Robinson with a block. Barrett with it. Hero picks him up. And it's Miami with a rebound. Martin outside. Hero on the wing. Robinson defending. Fades away. Hero with the bucket. Hero. The Knicks have gotten three or four shots to fall so far in the third. Now here's Brunson. Pass to Robinson. Back to Brunson. Randall outside. Two minutes remaining in the third. Two minutes. And he drives in. Spins. Out of bio with the rejection. What a menacing swap by Bam. Letting them know there are no easy shots when he's around. Back to Martin. Adebayo sets a screen. Martin pass to Adebayo for three. Lowry. That one doesn't drop. And New York will come the other way. Outside Barrett. Pass to Randall. Ball stolen. Lowry with it. Adebayo, a screen on Brunson. Lowry, the pass to Adebayo. Not going to go that time. Good work defensively by Robinson. Trying to find a spark here. Yes, indeed. A rough stretch offensively. They could really use a basket. Randall outside. Shot clock at five. Tries to snap the cold streak. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. Fourth personal foul. But on Martin. Well, with his strength, Julius Randle can absorb contact Julius easier Randall. than a lot of players. This guy is not going to two be shots. intimidated. The free throw drops for Randle. So for the Knicks. Hardenstein, he's checked in for Robinson, quickly comes in for Barrett, and it's Derrick Rose in for Brunson. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. Miami has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the third. Quickly against Oladipo. Ooh, excellent D there from Quickly. The Knicks have gotten three of six shots to fall so far in the third. About seven seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Let's it go from deep. Grimes' shot is off. The Heat with the lead. Here's Butler. Oladipo outside. From outside the arc. Hartenstein pulls it in. Quickly finds Randall. Oh, got it off in time, but it's no good. And we've reached the end of the third. It's the Heat leading by four. And don't go away. We'll be back in a few moments. It'll be the fourth quarter of basketball coming up next.
and it's time to bring up the State Farm assist to the game. And I'll tell you what, this was a no-brainer tonight. Take a look at the precision on this feed. Couldn't place it any better. And when you're the beneficiary of a pass that good, you better deliver, and he did just that. These teams locked in a very close contest. This fourth quarter promises to be a good one. Isaiah Hardenstein is out there with Obi Toppin. Then it's Josh Hart. Then there's Emmanuel Quickly. And it's Grimes in at the three. Small forward. So that's who's on the floor for the Knicks. No good from the wing. Well, you simply have to shake that one off, right? You can't let that kind of missed opportunity bother you. Here's Butler. It's deflected. They get it back. Back to Love. Oladipo outside. Second chance effort. Oladipo can't get that one to fall. New York trailing. Now quickly. Outside Hart. Clock at six. Pass to Hartenstein. Ooh, good finish at the rack off the slick feed. And you want him taking good shots at this point in the game. And that one was easy. Boy, when it's this close, you try not to give up these kinds of buckets. Boy, you got to do better defensively. Now here's Robinson. Oladipo outside. Here's Vincent. There's a screen by Love. For three, Robinson. And Toppin pulls it down. Fourth quarter now. We're about a minute and a half in. Quickly outside. Pass to Grimes. Here's Hardenstein. They get the rebound. Oh, it's no good. That would have tied it. The Heat have gone 0 for 3 in this fourth. Not good. Back to Vincent. Takes it inside. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. I like it. I mean, some physical play inside. He's not about to give up any easy baskets. And a closer look here at the scoring breakdown for Miami. I've been impressed with how assertive they've been offensively. Getting the ball into the low post and powering through the defense. Something else that they've had working for them is attacking the offensive glass. Boy, taking advantage and creating second chance points. Impressive. First free throw is good. So New York going with almost an entire new group here. Mitchell Robinson, he's checked in for Hartenstein. Julius Randle comes in for Toppin. R.J. Barrett, he's checked in for Grimes. And it's Jalen Brunson in for quickly. Bam Adebayo is checked in for Miami. Kyle Lowry comes in for Oladipo. That's also good. So he hits both free throws. Now a timeout called by New York. <laughs> With the offense really. Coach has to get these guys on the same page. And to me, they're just taking too many tough shots. And when they do get an easy one, the confidence are, just isn't there. And together for your next city dancer.
A different look for Miami. Martin, he's checked in for love. And it's Hero in for Vincent. Let's go now to the sideline and catch up with Ali LaForce. Thanks, guys. I was able to hear Tom Thibodeau coaching his team during that last break. He laid into the team about being over-aggressive. He said, quote, you're letting them get to the line as much as they want. We've got to dial back some of the physicality because it's getting us in trouble. Guys, let's see if they can ease up here. As always, Allie, we thank you. Now here's Brunson. Randall outside. Yes, and a nice assist from Brunson. Randall's got 20. Boy, Julius Randall is getting to his spots and starting to really cook. Butler passes to Hero. Butler against Barrett. Looking to get back on track. Butler can't get it to go. The Knicks have gotten only two of six attempts to drop in the fourth. And he lobs it up top. Brunson against Lowry. Oh, it misses. Had a chance to tie it. The Heat with the lead. Hero, the pass to Butler. Clear foul there on the missed shot. So he'll get a pair at the line. It goes on Josh Hart. Boy, with his power and explosiveness, when Butler gets inside, it's typically a bucket, a trip to the line, or sometimes worse, both. Drops the first. Butler hits them both. And it's the Knicks with the ball. Here in the fourth, they've allowed just four points. Randall, a screen on Butler. Inside. And it's Randall with the jam. Julius Randall under tremendous pressure with the big bucket. 36, 34. Here in the fourth quarter, just under two and a half gone by. And the foul called on R.J. Barrett. R.J. That's his first foul. First and there's just foul. one foul now Third away from foul. the middle. Pass to Butler. Lowry outside. Shot clock at six. Miami, no good that time either. He just couldn't finish the job that time. And too bad, because it was a nice look. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. First big, good whistle there. First team foul. Jalen Brunson at the line. Two shots. Makes it, and the next one could tie it up. And it's tied up with that one. You get the sense this guy relishes getting to the free throw line in these tough moments. You talk about clutch, this guy is it. Hart against Hero. Adebayo, a screen on Hart. Hero for three. It's rebounded by New York. Barrett's got four rebounds now. Pass to Hart to the left side wing. Barrett up top to take the lead. And he recovers it. Now here's Randall. Now Brunson. Randall on the screen. Second shot opportunity. And it's off the back of the rim. No good. Butler with the ball. And it's Brunson picking him up. And it's Butler off the drive. And 
And it's Butler with the can. We know this about Jimmy Butler. The guy has no fear. He delivers when his team needs it. Randall against Martin. Randall right side. Outside Brunson. The three. Book it. And it's Randall with the assist. Randall's got three assists tonight. Well, this is the all-around game for Julius Randall, right? We think that he can score it, board it, but how about that pass? Now here's Hero. Pass to Lowry. For three. It's hauled in by Robinson. New York has gone one for three in the fourth quarter from range. Robinson, a screen on Adebayo. Randall outside. The kick out to Brunson. Tipped. Right side, Barrett. Takes a three. Rebound by the Heat. Well, he just hasn't found his rhythm tonight. Partly because he's gotten fewer touches. Hard against Hero. Lowry outside. Back to Hero. Beyond the arc. Oh, he buries it from outside. <laughs> Great to see guys who don't back down under pressure. To me, more often than not, when you attack, good things happen. Now a timeout called by New York. They're down by two. 15 seconds left in the final quarter. All right, man. Give it up right now. For the next breaker after. Fifteen seconds left in the fourth quarter here. Randall against Martin. Up top, Randall. There's the triple. This is the three. So it's the Heat taking the W in a close one. And this was an emotional win for them. No doubt about it. <laughs> just a fantastic accomplishment. You love how they just diffuse the energy in this arena. All right, let's go courtside to Allie LaForce with our player of the game. Allie, it's all yours. Thank you, Jimmy. At times, it was not pretty out there, but you got it done. What made the difference? We just continually play hard. I think at the end of the day, um, defense is all about will, want to, and how hard you play. And we got a lot of guys that just play hard. The effort brought you the win. Congrats again. Thanks, Allie. Great interview once again. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. For Doris Burke, Ali LaForce, and Grant Hill, and all of our crew, this is Brian Anderson thanking you for watching this 2K Sports presentation of the NBA as we present our New Balance player of the game, Jimmy Butler.